Ladies and gentlemen, in the battle between law and grace, between legalism and liberty, between religion and relationship, grace wins. God does not need you to do anything to earn his love. You are responsible for only one thing, to put your faith in Jesus. Even in this area, God offers his help by giving a measure of faith to every person, according to Romans 12, 3. Kierkegaard wrote that the Christian receives everything by God's grace, even grace itself. He understands that he cannot do without God's grace even in praying for his grace. A newly born-again Christian is often full of excitement. Every day is a new adventure, learning to walk and talk with God. But as the new believer goes to church, he often begins to accumulate a mental list of do's and don'ts. And eventually, the new Christian stops enjoying life with Christ and puts his focus on earning God's love. He is like the church in Revelation who lost their first love. Once you are saved in God's eyes, you are holy, perfect, righteous, nothing lacking, completely worthy of entrance into the kingdom of heaven. When God looks at you, he does not see you in your human frailty. He sees Jesus. So if you are completely righteous and completely perfect in God's eyes from salvation on, what more is your good behavior earning you in terms of salvation? And so you don't earn your salvation, you are given salvation as a free gift from God.